Welcome to our video on the job role and career of an airport manager. An airport manager is responsible for the overall operation and management of an airport, including safety, security, and customer service. This includes managing staff, coordinating with airlines and other stakeholders, and ensuring compliance with regulations. The role requires a wide range of skills and experience, including leadership, management, and technical expertise. In this video, we will explore the duties and responsibilities of an airport manager, the qualifications and experience needed to pursue a career in this field, and the opportunities and challenges that come with working in the airport industry. Whether you're a student considering a career in airport management or an experienced professional looking to take your career to the next level, this video will provide valuable insights and information. So let's dive in and learn more about the exciting and dynamic world of airport management. Before we begin, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to our channel for more awesome content. Show us some love and we'll keep the good stuff coming. Airport Manager Job Description An airport manager is responsible for overseeing and managing all aspects of the operation and administration of an airport. This includes managing staff, coordinating with airlines and other stakeholders, and ensuring compliance with regulations. Specific duties and responsibilities may include Developing and implementing policies, procedures, and plans to ensure the safe and efficient operation of the airport. Managing budgets and financial reports and ensuring that the airport operates within financial constraints. Supervising and training airport staff, including security personnel, customer service representatives, and other employees. Coordinating with airlines, tenants, and other stakeholders to ensure the smooth operation of the airport. Ensuring compliance with all federal, state, and local regulations and laws, including safety and security regulations. Building and maintaining relationships with the community and other organizations to promote the airport and its services. Developing and implementing marketing and public relations strategies to promote the airport and attract new airlines and passengers. Preparing and submitting reports on airport operations, financial performance, and other relevant topics to airport boards, government agencies, and other stakeholders. Staying informed of industry trends, new technologies, and changes in regulations to ensure that the airport remains competitive and efficient. An airport manager typically requires a bachelor's degree in aviation management, business administration, or a related field, as well as several years of experience in airport management or a related field. Strong leadership, management, and communication skills are essential, as well as the ability to work under pressure and make quick, effective decisions. Airport manager salaries. The starting salary and earning potential of an airport manager can vary depending on factors such as the size of the airport, the location, and the level of experience of the candidate. According to data from the Bureau of Labor Statistics, the median annual salary for transportation, storage, and distribution managers, which includes airport managers, was $94,730 in May 2020. The lowest 10% of managers earned less than $63,660, and the highest 10% earned more than $168,580. Generally speaking, airport managers working in larger airports or in major metropolitan areas may have the potential to earn higher salaries, while those working in smaller airports or in more rural areas may earn less. Additionally, the earning potential of an airport manager can be influenced by the industry experience and performance. A manager with more years of experience and a proven track record of success may have the potential to earn higher salaries and more opportunities for advancement within the company. It's worth noting that the earning potential for airport manager also depend on the type of airport, for example, a manager at a major international airport may have a higher earning potential than one at a regional or general aviation airport. Airport Manager Typical Day a typical day in the role of an airport manager may involve a variety of tasks and responsibilities, depending on the specific needs of the airport and the manager's level of experience and responsibilities. Below is an example of a typical day in the life of an airport manager. 8 a.m. Arrive at the airport and meet with key staff members to review the day's schedule, including flight arrivals and departures, staffing levels, and any potential issues that may arise. 9 a.m. Meet with representatives from airlines, tenants, and other stakeholders to discuss operational issues and coordinate efforts to ensure the smooth operation of the airport. 10 a.m. Review and approve financial reports and budgets to ensure that the airport is operating within its financial constraints. 11 a.m. 
meet with security personnel to review and update security procedures and ensure that the airport is in compliance with all federal, state, and local regulations. 12 o'clock p.m. Take a break for lunch. 1 p.m. Meet with staff from various departments to review and update policies and procedures, and address any concerns or issues that may have arisen. 2 p.m. Attend a meeting with the airport board to provide updates on airport operations and present any important issues for discussion. 3 p.m. Review and respond to emails and other communications from airlines, tenants, and other stakeholders. 4 p.m. Attend a meeting with airport staff to review and analyze data on airport performance and identify areas for improvement. 5 p.m. Prepare reports on airport operations and performance for submission to government agencies, airport boards, and other stakeholders. It's worth noting that this is an example of a typical day, and the actual tasks and responsibilities may vary depending on the specific needs of the airport and the manager's level of experience and responsibilities. Additionally, airport manager may be required to work extended hours, including evenings, weekends, and holidays, depending on the airport schedule. Airport Manager Career Prospects The career prospects of an airport manager can be very promising, as the demand for airport management professionals is expected to grow in the coming years. According to the Bureau of Labor Statistics BLS, employment of transportation, storage, and distribution managers, which includes airport managers, is projected to grow 6% from 2020 to 2030, about as fast as the average for all occupations. One of the main drivers of this growth is the increasing demand for air travel, which is expected to continue to grow as the global population increases and economies continue to expand. As a result, airports will need to expand and modernize their facilities and infrastructure to accommodate more passengers and flights, and this will require the services of experienced airport managers. As an airport manager, you will have the opportunity to advance within the airport industry by taking on more responsibilities and moving into higher-level management positions. With experience, you could become a director of airport operations, a chief operating officer, or even a general manager. There are also opportunities to move into other roles in the airport industry such as working with airport consultants, airport equipment manufacturers, airport planning and design, airport security and safety, or airlines. Additionally, airport managers with a broad range of experience and skills may also find opportunities in other industries, such as transportation, logistics, and supply chain management. Overall, the career prospects of an airport manager are promising, with a growing demand for experienced professionals in the airport industry, as well as opportunities for advancement and career growth. Pros and Cons of Being an Airport Manager Being an airport manager can be a challenging and rewarding career, with a variety of pros and cons. Below are some of the key advantages and disadvantages of being an airport manager. Pros Leadership Opportunities as an airport manager, you will have the opportunity to lead and manage a team of staff, and make important decisions that affect the operation and success of the airport. Variety of work. The role of an airport manager is diverse and dynamic, with a wide range of tasks and responsibilities that can keep the job interesting and challenging. Impactful. The role of an airport manager is critical in ensuring the safe and efficient operation of an airport, and can have a significant impact on the community and economy. Career advancement. With experience, you can take on more responsibilities and move into higher-level management positions within the airport industry. Cons Stressful The role of an airport manager can be stressful, as you will be responsible for ensuring the safe and efficient operation of the airport, and dealing with emergencies and unexpected events. Long hours Depending on the airport schedule, you may be required to work extended hours, including evenings, weekends, and holidays. Heavy workload the role can be demanding, with a heavy workload, tight deadlines, and a lot of responsibilities. Compliance and regulations. The role requires to be aware of and comply with a wide range of regulations and laws, including safety and security regulations, which can be complex and time-consuming. In conclusion, being an airport manager requires a combination of leadership, management, and technical expertise, and can be a challenging and rewarding career. It's important to weigh the pros and cons and consider if this career aligns with your skills, interests, and goals. Airport Manager Interview Questions Here are some examples of questions that may be asked during a job interview for the role of an airport manager, along with some possible answers. Question 1. Can you tell us about a time when you had to deal with a difficult situation at an airport? Answer. One example that comes to mind is when a major snowstorm hit the airport I was managing and caused several flight cancellations and delays. 
I quickly assembled a crisis management team and worked closely with airlines, tenants, and other stakeholders to mitigate the effects of the storm. We arranged for additional staff to clear runways and taxiways, provided transportation and accommodation for stranded passengers, and kept everyone informed of the latest developments. Through our efforts, we were able to minimize the disruption to airport operations and restore normal service as quickly as possible. Question 2. How do you ensure compliance with safety and security regulations at an airport? Answer. Ensuring compliance with safety and security regulations is a top priority for any airport manager. To accomplish this, I stay informed of the latest regulations and laws by regularly reviewing updates from government agencies and industry organizations, and attending relevant training and seminars. I also establish and maintain effective communication with security personnel, airlines, tenants, and other stakeholders to identify and address any potential security risks or concerns. Additionally, I regularly conduct safety and security audits to ensure that all airport staff, equipment, and facilities meet or exceed regulatory standards. Question 3. How do you manage budgets and financial reports for an airport? Answer. Managing budgets and financial reports for an airport requires a combination of financial acumen and operational expertise. I start by working with the finance department to develop budgets and financial reports that accurately reflect the airport's operational and financial needs, and align with the strategic goals of the airport. I also establish and implement effective financial management processes, such as cost control, revenue management, and financial reporting, to ensure that the airport is operating within its financial constraints. Furthermore, I regularly review and analyze financial performance data and make adjustments as needed to optimize the airport's financial performance. Question 4. How do you handle customer complaints and concerns at an airport? Answer. Handling customer complaints and concerns is an important aspect of airport management. My approach is to first listen actively to the customer, understand the situation and their concerns, and then provide a clear and timely response. I also establish and maintain effective communication with airlines, tenants, and other stakeholders to identify and address any issues that may be causing customer complaints, and take appropriate action to resolve them. Additionally, I make sure that my staff is well trained on customer service, and have a clear protocol for dealing with customer complaints and concerns. It's worth noting that these are examples of possible questions and answers, but depending on the specific job requirements, the interviewer may ask different questions. It's important to be prepared for the interview and to have relevant examples from your experience that demonstrate your qualifications for the role.